YouTube, what is good? It's your boy JR, aka Soul and Tune, and I'm back. I got another vid for y'all today, man. Team Early unboxing right here. Y'all know, first ever for me. You know what I'm saying? I got this on a pre order, and I think this shoe is very, very dope. So if you're new to the channel, man, I want to appreciate y'all for stopping by. Like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you know when I drop these content. On my day one, people, man, I love y'all and I appreciate y'all, man. Thank y'all for pulling up, y'all being supportive, you know what I'm saying? And as always, man, I hope y'all are having a blessed day. Hope y'all are productive. Hope y'all are safe, you know, in this, in this, in this world, man. But we're going to get into it, man. So this right here, man, y'all see this box, man. This box is huge. Look at this, man. Look at this. Look at, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. You see this? But, yo, so this is Sneakerhead meets Techie. I love sneakers. I love technology. So this was a no-brainer for me to, to take a look at it, man. Take a look at it. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to raise this up a little bit. Just, yes. I'm going to show y'all. Y'all can go ahead and see this. The Nike Adapt Earl BB. All right? This right here is something, something special. You know what I'm saying? Something special. Yo, so Earl, Earl stands for Electric Adaptive Reactive Lacing. That's what Earl stands for. So when Nike talks about Earl, that is what they are talking about. And this right here is a basketball shoe. This is a basketball shoe, not like the the version that we had two years ago where it's a lifestyle shoe and things like that this right here cats be hooping in this kyle kuzman lakers all day la baby <laughs> and then that dude over in boston man Tatum. yeah I, you know what i'm saying but he hooping these too you know what i'm saying and i think more and more as time go by you're gonna see a lot more people hooping in this you know what i'm saying it's supposed to React and it's supposed to adapt to your foot as you go along. So it's gonna be quite interesting, man. So I know y'all wanna see this, man. So let me go ahead and get these out the box and then we're gonna take a closer look at these. Alright, I'll be back shortly. Alright, y'all. So before we get to the the full unboxing, you know what I'm saying? Just had to show y'all this. Maybe y'all can hopefully y'all can see it. Y'all see there's a Nike, Nike check right there at the box I'll show y'all size 13 I think this is 14 and a half in women right yeah 14 and a half in women so the tag actually reads Nike Adapt BB black reflect the silver and that's it uh, US 350 and they got these dots on the side and y'all y'all see why in a minute but yeah let's go ahead and and get this baby open. You know what I'm saying? Let's go ahead and knock this thing open. And and here we go. Gosh, oh yeah, they got got paper. Let me take this paper off. Throw it off to the side. And bam. The Nike Adapt BB. There we go. It's a beautiful shoe, ain't it? Pretty dope. Futuristic. And there you go. You see the two dots right there. So the dots on the side of the box shows two dots here. All right. So that was the that was the right shoe. This is. Le left, le left shoe. Give y'all a little overview of it. You know what I'm saying? Of course. And bam. All right. So let's 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 get into the shoe. Let's look at it. All right. So you have a you have a black mesh upper type material. It's not actually mesh, but it's actually some kind of material. I forgot what they call it, but it's a material that. It's supposed to give and stretch uh, four different ways, so it makes it a lot more durable than than your typical mesh upper. Okay, you have a 
a white midsole with the black Nike check right here. All right. On the back, there is another Nike check um, right here on this little panel right here. Y'all can see that. Turn to the sides, you have a gray Nike, a large gray Nike check coming through. And then where the midsole is, you have this black hit, and then there's another Nike check. And the gray silver Nike check is dot, dot, dot out in the back, as y'all can see right there. So then at the bottom, you have a clear with two dots right here. And also, turn to the front. There's a white material that's up under this, under this black material right here. That's why you get that gray type of look. And then you have uh, gray dots coming up here. This one right here shows a, a Nike check. There you go, Nike check. And then this one, your left shoe, shows the Nike word, the word Nike. So. Let y'all look at the, look at y'all look at the left one as well. So same thing, same thing on the on the left shoe is on the right shoe. And also, right here, you see these two things right here. This is actually your your button to loosen and tighten. So you hold it for one second, turns on. you can hear it now there's shoe trees in here so the the great thing about this is that it will tie into your foot and and once it feels that it's secured it would it will stop it it automatically stops you can hold the button to get down if you want to tighten it some more but it's going to lock down to to a comfortable level as you can hear it and then this button right here releases the lock and it moves it back into place so when you first turn on green means that it's that it has a good charge on it now there is an app to it um, that I know that is going to be available on on the iOS now Android it speculated that it's not going to hit all the Androids only specific ones like the Google uh, Pixel and I think the the Samsung Galaxy 8 and a few others you know I have a Note 8 so hopefully it hits for the Note 8 but but yeah, these buttons right here that loosen, tighten, so it's manual if you do not have the app, if you're not able to get to the app. And there's a lot of different features on the app. There's two different, you can have two different settings on the app. So you can have one for, for lockdown from where you're balling, and then you can have another setting from where you're walking around casually. You can also adjust the tightness and also how, how loose you would like for the shoe to be with the app as well. Uh, there is a L and a R standing for left and right, and you move either one up and down individually or together, and it will tighten and it will loosen the shoe as as you would like. Now you can also change the colors. I think there's maybe about uh, 10 colors that you can choose from at this time. This this technology actually has firm, firmware in it. I'm sorry, firmware. So that means that it can be updated. So you can have an update on this shoe, which is crazy. All right. So also, um, if you peel this back a little bit, I think right here, you can peel that back a little bit. Uh, you can kind of see the wire a little bit. I don't know. I'm gonna post a pic, man. I'm gonna post a pic like maybe right here, maybe bring it down so you guys can see the actual kind of lacing system that is in place that they showed on the Nike website. Which, I mean, I think this is a dope shoe, man. I mean, technology meets the sneaker community, man. Balling out of control literally <laughs> so yeah man i mean i hope y'all like this man if y'all going after this like i said these do release on february 17th 10 a.m nike sneakers app if you want them you gotta go get them all right so yes but check this out all right got a few more things yeah check this out i got a few more things all right so i'm gonna put these down right here Peak game. So, you know, this is a this is a technology shoe. So, you know, it's got technology and it has a battery. So you got to be able to charge it, right? This one comes with a wireless charging pad. 
trying to flex so you can kind of see kind of see the little two dots the little two things and then maybe you can see you see that Nike right there so this lays flat right also this is just the pad and then Nike with the with the gray with the with the silver aluminum type stuff again you know what I'm saying for for the uh, for the plug and y'all this is dope right here Nike Earl BB Nike Adapt Earl BB all right I'm pretty sure this is probably an instruction thing we're not gonna take that out though we're not gonna worry about that we'll put this stuff back but yeah so this is how it's used okay so basically you have your pad you plug it in right so you have it we're just gonna say that it's sitting right here okay so you take your shoe set it on there in the middle I got big feet so you know this is gonna be larger so you set it there damn you see it like see it's like sitting on the pad right charges it wirelessly wirelessly you do not have to plug your shoe in you charge it on the pad so just like the just like your phone the, the new iPhone and the Samsung uh, Galaxy series and and some of these other phones that have that that QI uh, charging system where you can just sit, set it on a pad and it charges same concept right here man and it's beautiful so the motor and everything is in in case where like I showed you where these buttons are right and they have they have special padding inside to absorb the the bounce of your foot and and the move the herky jerky and all the and all the movement of your foot so that it does not interfere with the motor which is crazy so that's just a little bit on the tech side I know some of y'all don't really really care about that but I just had to point that out that technology is in here and Nike Nike's becoming a part of a, a technology corporation you know they're bringing out these it's hinted that they are working on a running shoe this is one of the most adapted uh, shoes that they have uh, launched so they went through 51 different illustrations and 51 different testing regiments to make sure that this shoe could to, could last in performance all right so I think this shoe is dope I'm excited because you know when you know we seen the McFlies the Marty McFlies the mags you know and and that was all just a concept and in a couple of years ago they, they actually came out with their own self lacing but now you know you have a lifestyle shoe that they dropped that had that was seven hundred dollars of course but it's self laced right it's a little narrow on the fit oh and I also have to say that these these um these take comments from the silhouette like a Kobe like a Kobe uh shoe so they do fit narrow they do fit snug and and they are and they will keep your foot tight so if you like the Kobe 80s you will love this shoe because this shoe fits just like it and conforms just like it all right just had to point that out but now we're in the day of age where you have technology on your foot where you are able to loosen and tighten your shoe as you please and as you go along and also it being able to adapt to you that's why we hit adapt so I think this shoe was amazing I think this shoe is is a is a view as seen into the future so you know I hope you guys like the pics hope y'all like the vids as always man y'all like comment and subscribe bring in some stuff for y'all man for y'all before it drops so if you're looking for it before it drops man I got it right here you know what I'm saying more in the future more to come as always man I hope y'all are blessed man and everything man so we gonna end it out y'all know how I do man and I take the shoe and y'all be blessed y'all be safe and y'all stay up now holla at you soon soul and tomb tomb squad 2019 all right i'm gonna holla at y'all peace